yo yo guys as you may know on here double h half of trying to exist so yeah we're rolling down through and really um carefully looking at all of the different confederations cup teams and we go here to mexico mexico um rafael marquez is 38 so look for the for those Mexico boys, you know, you, you, we look back at the World Cup. And I think, you know, Ochoa was one of the standouts in that team. Oh, I, I sincerely hope Chicharito is here. I sincerely hope that Chicharito is here. Diego Reyes, um, Fernando Fernando, Peralta, I see no Chicharito. Here we go, good. Javier Hernandez, Chicharito, Chicharito number 14. Um, yeah, I mean, look, man, it's Carlos Vela. It's the team that we expected, you know, and I re I mean, I mean, for me, I'm always, every World Cup, Copa America, every tournament, I'm always excited to see Mexico. And I think that what the coach has to do is, you know, you're always going to get a team that is that very talented. So, but what Osorio needs to do is that let's take that good football and let's get some winning in there. I think what Mexico has always lacked, has always have lacked is the winning mentality that winner's mentality obviously very painful how they were not able to close the deal against holland again was it a penalty was it not a penalty, penalty blah 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 um but that's the thing because again like i told you does when giovanni dos santos and carlos vea put in a mexican chair those guys are our big time i've always said chicharito is still one of the most underrated finishers out there because as far as a poacher there are not that many better poachers than Chicharito, hence why he's already he's broken the Mexican goal scoring record as well. You obviously have your Oribe Peralta, who's like an alternative. Although I would not mind having a Peralta and a Hernandez too. I think a 4-3-3 or even like a 4-4-2 attack minded 4-4-2 would be interesting. Like if you have like a De Diamond and you have like a Hernandez and a Peralta. Let's see how they they, they, they both combine against each other. Um so I I think that really you know um Again, can Mexico win this? I'm not sure whether they, 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 they can, you know, but all I want from them is just to see a team that has a, a far better winning mentality. That's what I want to see. I know these guys can play very, very good football, but whenever those games get close, they just don't have that extra gear. And it's, and it's, 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 it's a mental thing because whenever it's 1 1, 10 minutes, you need that psychology of like you cannot make any mistakes. And when that chance happens, or when it comes to you've got to put away that chance, and that is what I need to see from them. So again, guys, to watch out for again, I think that that answer and kind of they're always good. Raul Jimenez, again, let's let's see. Forward, I've not really heard much from him. Um, but again, for Avi Hernandez, again, he's always a guy who is always doing his thing, and I think again, that's why I, I say switch to Rito. If the midfield do their work, you provide him. Hernandez will score because Hernandez is a very good finisher. But if you do not, because Hernandez is not the kind of guy that will actually create a lot of his goals or his shots. But if you provide for him, this is a guy that can definitely put away um, those balls in through to, to yours. So yeah, man, um, we we are waiting. We see, but but yeah, uh, Rafael Marquez thirty. I don't really know. So wait, is this guy really going to play a World Cup at thirty nine? That's just what I want to know because that's 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 old. <laughs> that's very old. But again, credit to the guy that he's still going, he's still being in there. And I just think that is a fantastic career. Um, and and he wants to retire, so definitely one hundred percent be a Mexican legend because to have been playing for this long, amazing. But as I say that, Blanco still plays. So 